there are many airsoft guns with all kinds of magazines. So let's give you the rule for AKs and M4s. Not only have my AK with me, but I do have some magazines. So. This is just something I want to know how to do. Alright. The fuck done now. Um. M4 mags are vastly more durable compared to AK mags, alright? Now this is sufficient, this will work, alright? It's not bad. And this isn't good. We do a lot more things with it, but um... Currently, from what I know, is... You can wind the shit out of these things. Like, you just fucking kill it, man. You can kill it. So, you know, little whiny wheel under here. Wind it forward. BBs come up here, keep it up, have more BBs, right, you can keep going, this works, this thing will not break, it don't hold as much as these though, now for this one, you, it, it's fragile, alright, so you don't need to do that much, now with the winding wheel is a lot bigger, I guess, I think it is, is it, no, nah, my thing popped out, so I think it's plus, so there you go, that's AK, right there. Done, that's how you wind your fucking mags. Sometimes you have to wind when you're shooting. Um, see how big of a deal with it. Uh, you just wind and then you shoot. Point name. I don't know. Fun stuff. You have to do that after every game or so. Because that, um... It, it wears on your gun, not on your gun, on your magazine, when you keep the BBs in there all wound up. So once you unwind it like this, it's, uh, it, 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 it's not going to fucking break or anything like that. It's not going to last like a week. It's going to last a really long time. It's a delicate kind of thing. And you just open up the, uh, whatchamacallit up here, right? See it? Open it up. Some BBs in there. Alright. Easy stuff. I mean, this isn't like something for like everyone to know, but I'm I, I'm fucking hundred percent sure that a good like ninety percent of uh, these airsoft players out here don't know how to wind mags. They don't. I fucking saw this pro like not not like it's a pro, not like uh like I think it was like Jet Desert Fox. He literally told the kid to wind his magazine wrong. He said, wind it until it stops, uh, until it gets really hard. These things are fucking weak as shit, man. These are, the springs in here, it's not a spring, it's, um, these, uh, what do you call it? The aluminum in here that makes, like, actually there's like little strips of aluminum they use for tension. I don't really know how it works, it just does. Um, the fucking aluminum in these things is the, it's the weakest shit. This thing will break if you fucking drop it weird. Alright. And by the way, metal mags are just as durable, like, polymer mags are just as durable as metal mags, as, like, sure you got all these externals and stuff, this is, I, I play, I spray paint this and played a game, alright? So this isn't, like, actual wear and tear. Wear and tear does not look like this. Um, this is all, like, simulated. But, um, basically, uh, these things will bounce, while these things will go thump. That's literally the only difference. You can throw these both against a brick wall, they will both break just as easily. Not externally. Externally, yeah, sure, this will break. Actually, not really, no. This is polymer bounce. This thing's, like, stamped together and shit. So if you break any of these stamps, it'll fuck. It will fuck. And plus, it's got plastic up on here and on here. Now, these things, you have to modify them, so you have to put a bit of tape over here to actually get them in. So if you have feeding problems, which this thing always does, even with this tape, it's, uh, that's good. Be okay. Um, Mag really sucks ass on this thing. I don't like it. This is a $180 gun. Um, so this right here and stuff. Right, that's about it. Now, if you actually want to know how to uh, be tactical, do the second part of this video. I'll show you. And there you go. Okay, fucking don't run in fours because they're shit. Give me a second. 
I don't have four hands. Let's go to part two.